name of Jesus. Amen. We do not want you to end up being lost for eternally. Jesus Christ paid the price. He cares enough for you. He loves you. You do not want to wall in, in pity, darkness, deception. He cares for your soul. He wants to set you free. Jesus Christ is on the throne. He's in full control. The devil is a liar. Satan has no control and power over you other than what you're given. God is a merciful God. He's a righteous king. Amen. He's on his way back, Buffalo, New York. Repent. Time is short. Time is short. Do the right thing. Trust in Jesus. Let the power and anointing of the Holy Ghost deliver your soul from hell. Let the truth of the word of God set you free. The Bible says in the book of Hebrews 4 and 12, for the word of God is sharper than any two-edged sword, even piercing and dividing the soul and the spirit. Amen. He's a holy God. The spirit of truth. Amen. A lot of people don't believe in things until they see it, but the Bible says in the book of Hebrews 11 and 1, now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. But without faith it's impossible to please God, for he that comes to God must believe that he is, and that he is a rewarder of those who diligently seek him. Not only when it's convenient, not only when you're in pain, not only when you feel like it, but I'm letting you know that Jesus Christ says, pray without ceasing. Amen. Praise God. Seek the living God. Amen. Because it's too late. Seek the living God before it's too late. This is my word to you. And this other truth is from God. I'm letting you know that God says in his word to seek ye first the kingdom of God. Because you cannot serve two masters. You love this world system and you hate God. Or either you love God and hate this world system. The Bible says a friend of this world is an enemy of God. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. For all things that's in this world is the lust of the flesh, the lust of the eyes, the pride of life. Jesus Christ cares enough for you. He does not want you to go to hell. Time is short, Buffalo, New York. Repent. Get your house in order. Turn away from darkness. Let Jesus make a difference in your life. Let the word of God deliver your soul from hell. Time is short. You may not have much time left based on what's going on. You understand what's going on. Maybe you don't care, but I'm letting you know. I'll give you a crash course right quick. There could be missiles over our own skies in any moment, but are you prepared? Are you prepared for the demise that this wicked world system has set up for you and I? This evil beast system, the antichrist system, the false prophet, which both will be thrown into the lake of fire. They know it. And the devil, because his time is short, he knows it's all, it's all over with. Why you think things are happening so quickly? Time is short. Time is short. It's time to quit playing games. It's time to get right with Jesus. Let the word of God direct the footsteps, amen. The Bible says, God's word is a light into my path, into my feet. Amen. What's he saying now? Amen. It's a light into my path. Praise the name of Jesus. The word of God says his word is like a lamp into my feet and a light into my path. He's a righteous God. He's a merciful judge. Amen. And if you confuse, the Bible says that Jesus Christ, God is not the author of confusion, but the devil is. Satan is a liar. He wants to send your soul to hell. That dark, unclean, evil entity, the wicked spirit that's in this world is a deceiver.
Praise the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. He's holy, amen, Jesus. He's a merciful God. He's a righteous judge, amen, Jesus. Praise the name of Jesus Christ. He's holy. Hallelujah. He's a good God. He's a merciful God. He's on his way back, Buffalo. Repent. Hallelujah. Repent. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Who will hearken to the word of God in these last and wicked days? Who will even believe in the Bible anymore? But it's kind of funny when your spirit is ready to leave your soul. Now you're interested. But that's, that's not human nature. And that's okay. But I'm letting you know it's not okay to stay asleep to the things that's going on around you. Time is short. You and you alone can only do something about it. Praise God, Jesus. 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 Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. He's a holy God. Things is going on. This is September. It's about to be October. A lot of events supposed to take place. A lot of unsavory circumstances. God bless you. It's supposed to come about in these wicked upcoming weeks and months. But I'm letting you know, do not be afraid. For God is on the throne, amen. Jesus Christ is in full control. Have courage. Have faith. Trust in the word of God. Put your faith where it's supposed to belong in these last and wicked days. That's in the hands of Jesus, amen. Praise Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord, Jesus. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Time is running out, amen. Hallelujah, it's running out. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus, hallelujah. Yes, Lord, thank you, Jesus. He's holy, amen. He's more powerful than any dark, unclean, fallen angel, demons, and devils, evil, wicked spirits. God is a powerful God to give you, if you're a child of God, the authority over the wickedness and the darkness. The Bible says He should give you power. He cast out devils in these wicked days. He's a holy God. Don't be afraid of what man can do to you. Be afraid of what God can do to you. He's holy. I see a lot of this going on. Huh? Where are you from? From Buffalo. Yeah. I'm free to so Yeah. What church do you call? Amen. Amen. So all over Buffalo, 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 and it's rare that I guess so many people, you know, different people come up. His name was David. He said, I'm like King David in the Bible. So yeah, cool. God bless you. So we started sharing the gospel and then he started sharing it. He goes, this is what God has me to do because time is real short. And I have a burden in my heart. The Holy Spirit is touching my soul. Going to the highways and Bible. You know, share the gospel. Let them know the time is a blessing. I'm uh that thing, I am, I am a soul. It's not as well as that. That's a good one. I got that at a uh, good car center. Uh, and it was like, where is it? 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 Where is
Confusion. And so many people are confused. Yeah, I live on in, in Chicago over here. Uh, okay. All right, hold on for one minute. God bless you. I don't want to.